Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to my little Canadian kingdom. Today, we are back out in Mon Bazoo, and as you can see, I've been busy making family-friendly oregano. That's because the farming slash bunker update has come out, and I wanted a lot of seeds for that. So, yeah, the harvest has been plentiful. Uh, I think the majority of these... Hey, how did you guys get here? Hold on. I thought I got rid of all my potatoes. I am no longer a potato farmer. I have moved up in the world so be gone you i actually need more poutine anyways because i clearly don't have enough <laughs> But yeah, since the last episode, I have been busy earning money because I know anything in this game costs a crap load of money. And this new update, as I said, it's all about farming in the bunker. There's also some new land uh, that we're supposed to be able to explore. Oh, I just ran out of cheese curds. Good timing, I guess. So yeah, I know I needed a lot of money for this. And I'm assuming I might even need some family-friendly oregano as well. So uh, hopefully the harvest is plentiful right now because I have quite a bit over here but not as much as I hoped for. Also, I guess there was uh, a Canada Day update. So we got Quebec flags everywhere. I don't know if that's the only thing in the update. Also, we have infestations now. Now, from what I've seen, if I just let them grow a little bit longer, the infestation goes away. So I'm not too worried about it spreading to my other crops. But yeah, there's like plant health now too, which is interesting. And yeah, I'm just super excited to be back and not have to deal with maple syrup for once. Hopefully this will be a lucrative business. I gotta assume it will be. Because yeah, I am so done at looking at maple trees. There we go. So we got three baskets full. We're going to uh, package this stuff up. Okay, and after the full harvest, yeah, we had uh, four slow growers. This one's almost done. It might even be done in a, a couple minutes here, but I'm not too worried about that. Now, I'm not going to replant them in case we can plant them in our new farm. And yes, this is definitely my best harvest yet. Uh, <laughs> I hope we have enough. Okay, there's there's weed. Oh, sorry, oregano falling everywhere. All right, there we go. All the big packages now. Man, that was a really good harvest. That was 40, a little over 40 packs. All right, so yeah, that's a pretty good load. Um, you will take that with us. I'm assuming we can sell there because it's hard to sell the 10 packs. My brother only buys one every like few months, so I'm hoping I can sell there. I have no idea where it is, by the way. So we're just going to uh, hit the mainland. Or I not actually the mainland. I call it the mainland. There's a new place called the mainland. Actually, I wonder if it's on the map. Um, okay, yeah. Top north on the old mainland, what I consider the mainland. It looks like there's a massive new bridge. So if we don't find anything in town, obviously we'll hit that bridge. Oh, look at that. We got a little, uh, uh, or, or should I say a massive bonfire here at the church. Also shady dealers here. Thought I'd see if he has anything new. It's looking like the same old stuff, all the good stuff. I still have the rally shocks here that I bought. One day I'll install them. Do I have the, I don't have the fiberglass uh, trunk. I guess I'll buy that and we'll just keep it here. One day we'll install it. Uh, I don't know why I'm here. Let's keep going. Oh my God. Is that ever a bridge? This is super exciting. So it's said to be small for this update, uh, but obviously it's a work in progress. So we'll see how big it is. It looks freaking massive. I do see uh, a hilly road over there and I didn't really look in town too much, but I didn't see anything new. So I'm assuming the new dealer is over here. All right, so yeah, we're gonna go up the hill first. Wow, this is a pretty insane road. Not much here besides the old Canadian wilderness, but that's fine with me. It'd be a good road to just drive on too if you wanted to test your car. Um, this is nice and windy, as you can clearly see. Oh, we got a, a dirt trail, it looks like. All dirt trails lead to something exciting. So let's uh, go a little bit of off-roading here. If my car can, Jesus, get up here. Man, this is a very hilly terrain. Man, this just keeps going and going. We've hit the coastline. Ooh, I wonder if there's new things for the boat. I feel like the boat has been something that's been added, but you don't really use it too much. I guess it's a good thing to get to your cabin, but that's about it. What is that red thing? I saw, do you see that? There's red over here. Oh, there's a barn. Hold on, the road probably leads there. Let's not get stuck in a ditch or something. Aha! What the hell is this? Like a farming area? It's It's got a sell point. All right, so what do I sell here? Place 12? Did you just say 12 big packs of weed to unlock the D? Oh, 12? 
God, I thought I I spent so long setting up that I don't think. Yeah, I definitely don't have 12 here. I think we're gonna have to do another harvest. I should have planted my my totally legal ore oregano after all. Mind you, I don't know why I'm not saying the actual word. It is totally legal where I live. Well, as per usual in Mon Bazoo, nothing is easy. And 12 big packs, that is so much. Like, I have been growing that for months and still I don't have enough. Mind you, the next harvest should be uh, more than enough. I think we're pretty close here. Uh, does it actually update in the box so we can actually visually see? So it looks like we need one. Oh my God, we need three more. I think I have two in here. Are you serious? Okay, I have one. Still, I only need two more? God damn it, and I have to wait for a whole new harvest. All right, well, while we're here, we may as well check the rest of this place to see if there's anything else added yet. And uh, yeah, I will say it said it was small. This is a massive island. I guess it's just barren though. All right, so that makes sense. So the road's blocked off over here, and I think this just kind of wraps back down to the bridge. All right, and yeah, that's it for mainland right now. Just a massive road and a big barn. Um, so yeah, back to uh, growing, I guess. And it shouldn't take too long. I'm just going to do the uh, sleep and save uh, strategy where you can just kind of pass the days quickly. Still gonna take a while to let them grow though. Oh, these are new. Oh, it's closed. There's planters now. Oh, I wonder if we can get the wheelbarrow now. Of course, I'm always in town on Sunday when everything's freaking closed. So yeah, we'll come back and see if we can maybe get that wheelbarrow because that would be pretty cool. One thing's for sure. I sure hope they uh, have like an auto watering feature because this is the most annoying part of this. I had to add more <laughs> to this as well because we have so many seeds now. And look at that. Through the power of editing, we have a lot more to harvest. Oh, that took about a week, but uh, not too bad thanks to my uh, gaming addiction on the PC. So yeah, I just gamed and slept. So this should definitely be enough, I'm assuming. Some of them are still growing. As you can see, they should be fully grown by the time we're done this. Not that we need them all anyways. We only need two packages worth. Well, that was a plentiful harvest. I am overflowing right now. So yeah, we definitely have at least two here. There's two right there. Oh man. Okay. I'm I'm so excited for this because I'm curious to see if this is going to be as good as maple syrup or not. Wow, that was like seven packages in one harvest. So yeah, the seeds are incremental, by the way, if you don't know. So every time you harvest, you gain two seeds, I believe, for every one plant. So it's going to expand quickly. I'm curious to see how much space we're going to have in this farm. Because uh, yeah, this definitely could be the most profitable thing in this game after a couple harvests. So I'm super excited. Um, let's take this over here. We'll, we'll take the rest too in case we can sell it. And let's finally get another method of earning some serious cash in this game. Because I, I don't want to look at maple trees anymore. All right. I sure hope I don't have to come here very often. Because man, is that a trek. It's in the middle of nowhere for obvious reasons now that I think about it. But here you go. The final two. Two. I didn't even notice. Uh, I was actually getting paid for these, so at least that's a good thing. Seems like we can do business. Minimum we buy is 27 big packs. 27. Holy crap. Is that it, though? Is this an... Okay, this has to be where we buy things, right? Um, hello? Is this just a legit barn? Or am I gonna get murdered? Hello? Oh, okay. Well, here's your store hours. Oh, it's locked? Oh, I'm, I'm 30 minutes early. Sorry, I'm very punctual. Okay, it's the big 10. Come on, guys. You're a minute late. <laughs> guys, you just opened. Clearly, you don't waste any time here. Uh, I don't know what I expected, but honestly, this was kind of it. Hello, Bobby. What it do, buddy? Dave's? How's it going? Name I can't pronounce, but your name your nickname's the lit. Ye okay, I, I hate all of you. Sebastian, just be careful, man. Um Alright, so this is the under the house bunker. 40,000. I knew it would be a lot. We can also upgrade a big electric compost machine. Holy crap, this is all so expensive. Oh, we have a huge harvest basket, though. That's honestly the most important part. There's nothing more annoying than the small harvest baskets in this game. 
All right. Well, we're obviously going to buy the bunker. Um, I don't know which one I want. Do I want the huge packager or the big electric compost machine? I believe I was reading the update notes and I believe this is for trees to make trees grow faster. It might make, you know, special trees grow, grow faster as well. But I feel like this machine. Oh, you need to have the big bunker at home to upgrade the machine. Dude, can you guys just put it in right away? I, I, I don't know how long it's going to take. I didn't read the top. Uh, I'm assuming it's going to take like a week though. So I guess we'll come back and buy this later. Oh. I thought that was outside of my real life house. They're working on it. I hear them. Where, where are they? Are they here? I mean, it's a bunker. Oh, they're right under my field. I think. How big is this thing? If the sounds louder here, I have a feel like this bunker is going to be huge. <gasps> we just completed the bunker. You shall look at the drain of your bathtub. Wait, what? How am I getting down a drain? Oh my god, that, that was like a week. It took so long. I guess it does take a long time to build a bunker. I'm kind of nervous. Hold on, let's go get some uh, maple syrup. Uh, okay, I am ready. I am so excited for this. I should also grab my seeds. Where the hell are they? Uh oh. Wouldn't that be hilarious if I lost them? There we go. All right, we're going to keep you there. Uh, hello? Well, this looks normal. Look at the drain. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god that is amazing oh i love it well i guess i'm not taking any showers anymore not that i ever freaking did they actually hold on for science i i'm more interested by the lowrider uh bathtub than my actual bunker we have to try this though here we go goodbye cruel world oh look at that i ripped right through why why did i just okay okay there we Let's not do that again. That's dangerous. Welcome. Oh my god. It's so dark in here. Hold on. I have a flashlight Dude, is there power? This is so cool power turn it on. How do I get dirt in here? Oh, there's speakers so you can sing to the plants I do hear that if you play classical music to plants they grow faster So I wonder if that's actually a thing in here. Look at how big this is Oh, I knew it was gonna be big too when I heard uh, them packaging. So we do have the big cannabis pack packager. Um, the other one was bigger though. Oh, and here's the planters. I saw them earlier. So do I just place them in here? I don't know what any of this is. System, irrigation system. Okay, let's arouse the plants. Oh, oh my God. I love it. I no longer have to water. The only downside is I need a crap load of these things because if this is how we're we're dealing with this, this is insane. I, I can only buy a few a day too. At least the store only stocks a few, so I don't think it will restock in time. Um, I don't know why I'm putting them all the way back here. Let's, let's put them closer to us right now. So yeah, we need planters. That is gonna take a long time to get. That's unfortunate. I wish I could just bring dirt down here and fill the whole thing with dirt. Also, I thought we were doing this at my cabin. If you remember, there's a basement in my cabin too. I wonder if that has a bunker now too. Anyways, we'll bring the seeds down and we'll just see how this works. So yeah, it's already n no lights. Wait, no, no lights. What the hell are you talking about? Do I have to put them directly underneath the lights here? Oh no, now it says it's good. Control room auto watered. Okay, so as long as it fits on this pad, I'm assuming we're good. And it auto waters every day at 10. Oh, this is great. Is this fertilizer? Yes, auto fertilizer. Wait, where do I get fertilizer now? All right, well, let's make a trip to town. We need uh, a lot of uh, pots. So where's my truck? I haven't used my truck in so long. Oh, yeah, there it is. I remember now. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna have to go buy some stuff. Maybe we can find some fertilizer too. Maybe even at the maple store? I have no idea. So yeah, it looks like we can buy a total of, what, seven? That's an odd number. But yeah, seven planters a day. I'm gonna look really weird buying seven planters every day here. That's actually not bad. It's still gonna take so long to get uh, as many planters as I have weed seeds. And, and after every harvest, it's only going to double. So yeah, I'm just gonna be very friendly to the Center D Decoration Store because I need so many of these. So freaking many. Oh, you have more. I'm stealing all of these. Thank you. Oh, that's a that's a cute little plant. I want it. I'm buying it. Yay. 
the first decoration I bought in the game. I, I guarantee we're, we're going to lose some, but you know what? This, this is good enough. There we go. Just get my key that's glitching out right now. Screw off, plants. Oh my God, I can't even start my car. Okay, it's on my roof now. Perfect. That's exactly what I want. It's on my head. Is it still in the car? Ah, oh, there's one here. We're just going to leave it. Clearly, we're going to have to use the trailer, I think. All right, they're just falling everywhere. Oh, my God. Okay, this is awful. This is awful. I haven't even left the store. All right, there's no way there's more staying on here. We're just going to go on too bumpy of roads, so we'll have to get the uh, trailer. That would be easy with that because it's got sides. Okay, and my little operation grows a little bit more. Uh, I think we'll wrap up this one here, guys. I do want to figure out the fertilizer. I know there's that fertilizer um machine at the new barn i don't think there was fertilizer there though so um i would like to figure out that obviously i have a lot more to do to actually build a massive grow up here but i'm i'm seriously curious to see how lucrative this is and it is super exciting to see that we have an auto watering feature here it's gonna make actually farming so much easier even if you just want to do potatoes uh for your poutine even that's going to be so much easier because there's nothing more annoying than dealing with this stupid watering can. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the new Mon Bazoo update. We'll probably have another episode where I have to go buy a lot of those pot plants. And yeah, we'll just finish up actually setting up our super secret new room. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.